लो ड्रामा वाले तैयार हो जाए so when krishna saw all this the other gopis had become had developed false ego that we are the same as radharani also radharani had developed anger some man towards krishna he is treating me the same as other gopis krishna was thinking this then ras will be broken therefore krishna disappeared from the arena of ras the gopis thought Where has he gone? Where has he gone? They became mad in his separation, and they remembered his pastimes. How he talked beautifully. How his form is sweet. How his flute playing is all attractive. And they became completely absorbed in Krishna and began searching for him. They saw big trees like pipal tree, mango tree, and kadamba trees. The Gopi said, "Oh trees, you are great sadhus, munis, rishis." You are doing austerities, therefore you have vision of everything. Please tell us which way did Krishna go? But the trees did not answer. Therefore, Gopi said, "Oh, you are males, therefore you are on the side of Krishna." Therefore, the Gopis asked the Tulasi tree, "Oh, Tulasi, you are very fortunate. You are always happy because you are always in connection with Krishna, either on his garland or on his feet." You are very happy. Therefore, tell us which way did Krishna go? But Tulsi did not speak. Therefore, Gopi said, "You must be so much happy having met Krishna. You cannot speak, or maybe also you are the side of Krishna." Therefore, they asked everyone. There was one tree with flowers blossoming. Therefore, the Gopi said, "Krishna must have touched you here. Therefore, you are happy. Therefore, flowers are on you." But the tree did also not did not say which way Krishna had gone. That time the gopis became so much absorbed in Krishna they became like Krishna. One gopi said, "Aham Krishna, I am Krishna." And saying like that, she lifted her cloth and said, "Look, I am lifting Govardhan." It is not that the gopis became Krishna, one with Krishna in every sense, but for Lila they became absorbed in this mood. One gopi became said, "I am Yasoda." Another gopi said, "I am Bhutana," and they performed that Lila. Actually, there is a secret thing here that Yoga Maya infused the mood of Putana in that Gopi, or else we can think that Yoga Maya made the form of that Gopi. Otherwise, no Gopi can independently become envious of Krishna like Putana. Therefore, they imitated Krishna's lila. As they progressed onwards, they saw the signs, the foot, Krishna's footprints in the ground with 19 symbols, like elephant, goat, fish, water pot, flag. But in between those two feet of Krishna was some smaller size of feet. Whose feet were they? The Vipaksha Gopis, the Gopis who for Lila perform the pastimes of being against Radhika. They said, "Anaradita, you know, Bhagwan Hari Desoro." Who is this Gopi? We don't know, but definitely she is the most fortunate. Anaradita, you know, because having left all of us, Krishna, she is alone with Krishna. Therefore, she has worshipped Bhagwan or Ishwara or Hari more than anyone else because Krishna has taken her. But the Swapaksh Gopis, those who are on the side of Radhika, like Lalita and Vishaka, become most ecstatic. Oh, they are the footprints of our Swamini Shrimati Radhika. Some time on, they could not see the footprints of that other Gopi. Therefore, they could understand that Krishna must have carried her. On one tree, they saw that that tree was devoid of flowers, where there should have been flowers. Also, Krishna's feet were there, but not the heel, only the toes, because he had stood on his toes to pluck the flowers. Therefore, with those flowers, Krishna was decorating the hair of Shrimati Radhika. Therefore, Krishna got a new name, Keshav, one who decorates the kesh or the hair of Shrimati Radhika. Shrimati Radhika was thinking. My friends, like Ladit and Vishaka, have given up everything for me. Therefore, it is not proper that I will be alone with Krishna. If they could also share this good fortune, I would be happy. Therefore, Radhika, in order to give the other gopis the chance to serve Krishna, she said, "I am very tired. I cannot go. Please take me wherever you like." 
Then Krishna could see the other gopis coming behind. Therefore Krishna was thinking, if those other gopis see me with Radhika, they will be envious of her. Therefore, what to do? My pastimes are complete here because Radharani's mind is pacified and the e false ego of the other gopis that we are equal to Radharani has also been broken. Therefore, if I disappear, the gopis can be together, then again we can have Ras. Thinking this way, Krishna disappeared. The Guru Mahal said a new point I never heard before. That really this Ras Lila proved the super excellence of Radharani. Because when Krishna disappeared at that time, Shimadi Radhika fell unconscious. At that time, no other gopi had fallen unconscious. Only Radhika fell unconscious. Therefore, that is proof of her super excellence. Also, leaving aside all other millions of gopis, Krishna only took Radhika. Therefore, he only performed Raslila for her happiness. Therefore, this is all proof of the Srimad Bhagavatam of the topmost position of Srimad Radhika. When all the gopis came upon Radhika weeping, then even those who are vipaks against the group of Radhika, even they felt compassion for her. Oh, she is also weeping like us. Therefore, all met together and began weeping. That time, they said, to break our mind, Krishna will took only you. When Krishna disappeared, where did he go? He went to Imlitala, just behind Keshigat, just behind Keshigat, and there he became absorbed in thinking of Radhika. Radha Chinta Nivesana Yasikanti Balopita Sri Krishna Chanam Bande Radha Ninjita Vigraha. There in Imlitala in Sevakunj, Krishna sat alone under that tree and remembering Radhika, remembering Radhika, remembering Radhika, he achieved the complexion and the mood of Radhika and became Sachinanda Gora Hari. Therefore, all these pastime places are there in Vrindavan, Srihavad, Sevakunj, Imlitala. That time all the gopis met together and began singing their prayers of lamentation that is called Gopigit. And tomorrow we will hear about that. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. This morning, the devotees who received initiation, please be ready. Good day from now on, announce your new transcendental name. Damana Hara from Hawaii. New name is Damota Taski. Antonio. Damota Taski. Stand up, Antonio Sanchez Diaz from Mexico. Anupam Das. Nena Krishna. There is no anyone beautiful like Krishna, so Anupam. That is Mother Maria Elena Grasso. Oh, Malati Dashi Ki. Viviana Martinez. Vilasini Devi Ki. Rodrigo Martinez. Oh, Ramana. Ramana Prabhu Sakya. Ramana Ne Dasita. So, Radhika Na Krishna. And receiving Diksha, Madhusudan Das Prabhu. And receiving Harinam, he is very famous, devoted all youths and also Jai Narayan Singh, new name. Jai Narayan. Jai Narayan. Pascal Rainier. Receiving Harina. Ramleka Devi Ki. Marino Victoria. Receiving Harina. Oh, Gaur Harita. Mirta Janet Rodriguez. Oh, Mathurika Devi Ki. Srita Steve Miki. Sri Niki. 
and then receiving Diksha, Indu Prabha Devi Rasi. Indu Prabha Devi Rasi. Receiving Harinam, Krishna Smaranam, new name is Krishna Das Prabhu Ki. Receiving Harinam, Vrindavani Kera Kermai. Oh, Vrindavani Dasi Ki. Now we start drama. Hare Krishna, please start. Hare Krishna, uh, just uh, one announcement for tomorrow's program. Uh, Mangal Arati will be at 5.30 in the morning. And at 7.30 in the morning, Sripad Tirth Maharaj will be speaking on the 7th Dashmul. At 10 o'clock, Sripad Padmanabh Maharaj will be speaking on Srimad Bhagavatam. At 11.30 tomorrow, we have presentations by Shyamarani Didi on Bhakti Arts, uh, by Vishwambha Prabhu on Bhakti Projects, by Mahabudhi Prabhu on the different educational programs, and Nemi Maharaj on the different preaching programs. So at 11.30 in the morning tomorrow. And at 3 p.m., uh, Nemi, Sripad Nemi Maharaj will be speaking on the 8th Dashmul. And so all of you please kindly uh, attend this festival. And uh, now the drama will begin on Sudama Vipra. Almost 5,000 years ago, when Lord Shri Krishna, after defeating demon Kansa, went to study in Gurukul of Sandeep Nimoni, there he met a Brahmin boy called Sadama. Gradually, Sadama and Krishna became good friends. One day, of Gurudev, wife of Gurudev said, Oh, Prabhu is going to rain, and we have no firewood. Please send the boys out to the forest to pick the wood. <coughs> Krishna, Sudama. Yes, Gurudev. Please go to the forest at once and collect some wood. It is going to rain, and we do not have any. As you wish, Gurudev. As soon as they entered the forest, heavy rain and thunder broke, but they collected the wood and made a bundle and put it on their head. <laughs> their bodies were wet and shivering. But they were sheltering the wood for Guru's service. Friend, it looks like we lost our way. What are we going to do? Don't worry, I'm with you. Let's sit down here. Oh, I'm really hungry. I wish we had something to eat. My dear friend, I, I ask Michana, please take it to satisfy your hunger. Thank you, my friend. Thank you, my friend. I'll never forget your generosity. One day I'll repay you. Please go out to look for them. 
Let's go and look for Krishna and Sudama. Krishna! Sudama, where are you? Krishna! Krishna! Sudama! Where are you? Sudama! Krishna! Sudama! Where are you? Krishna! Krishna! Sudama! Where were you? What were you doing all night? We were in the forest collecting woods for you. Oh, I am so pleased with your devotion. You have endangered your lives for me. I grant you one boon. All the knowledge of the Vedas will dwell in you, and you will become experts in 64 types of arts and learning. Then they returned to Gurukul. After some time, they returned to their homes. Krishna came to Mathura, and from there he went to Dwarka. After some time, he became king of Dwarka and married Princess Rukmini. Sudama also returned to Dwarka and married a Brahmin girl. Sudama did not care for worldly pleasures, always chanting and remembering Krishna. Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Can you give me some Viksha? Here's the Viksha from today. Please use them as a prasadam. Dear friend, King of Dwarka, he is Brahman Deva, and well was sure of Brahmins, and you are a Brahmin. Surely he will give something for you. Why should I go there? I don't need to go there. But you should go, not for yourself, but for the sake of your family. But he knows everything, the past, present, and future, and I'm happy with what I have. I will not go there. But you need to take care of us. Okay, if you say so, then I shall go. But only for the dash for the dash of the lotus feet of my lord. But wait, can you get a gift for me? Okay. There was nothing in the house to be given to Krishna. Brahmani went to her neighbors. Can you please spare some grain for me? This is all we have. Even take a nice gift from a friend. He is almighty, the king of the universe. How small and wretched I feel. Anyhow, he took it and kept it under his armpit and started his journey. Whole day walking miles and miles and miles. In evening, he reached. When he came to the open gates of the palace at Dwarka, no one stopped him as he entered. As it was the order of Lord Krishna, no Brahmin and devotees shall be stopped any time. Such 
Swagatam, my friend. Swagatam. for me. should be given to him. But Lord Krishna gave nothing. They embraced each other and went on their way. Sudama, while walking back, thought, My Lord has not given me anything. He would have given me anything. Wealth, maids, palaces. But that would have ruined my bhakti. I'm so glad he didn't do that. Thank you, my Lord. strong faith in Krishna. Be like Sudama, Nishkinjan doesn't want anything from Krishna and then you will see that Krishna will give himself to you. And Krishna says, Na pare ham nirvatya sanyucham sa sadhu kritam vibhu swapi Ya ma bhajan durja gahe shrinkhala samvrishya tad vaha Griyatam sadhuna O gopis, I am not able to repay my debt for your spotless service even within a lifetime of Brahma. Your connection with me is beyond reproach. You have worshipped me cutting off all domestic ties which are difficult to break. Therefore, please let your own glorious deeds be your compensation. Gaur Premanandi.
वेरी गुड कृष्ण वेरी गुड वेरी गुड कितनी मनी लेट वेरी गुड एंड ही वाई ओ वेरी गुड then sudama also very good role and other boy a student and sudama wife that is wife of sandipni muni that played very good role my blessings to you all try to be like sudama bipra So Dhamma Pitra, what a student with Krishna in some deeply many school, and by to please some deeply many wife, they went to forest. Oh, so much rain there! Even they collected so many wood, wooden, wood things, and they. Painted it and kept on their head whole night that this road should not be wasted. But one thing I could not understand: what they were eating there? Never written anywhere. Who had com- composed this story? Who? Who is the compiler of this story? I have not told that they are they are eating anything. <laughs> no, it has not been written. So this is something wrong. And then, oh, you go here. So Dama uh, was with Krishna. They were friends. But when Krishna became the king of Dwarka, Sudama was very akinchan Vishnu. He never wanted any wealth, anything. So he did not care for wealth. Anyhow, he, his wife, Garbi, Dwarka Chaturki, did it. So she was thinking, "Oh, my husband always is sad. So something I cook by fixture, huh? by baking. I cook. I give to my husband, but for he keeps for me only something. So he has become like old." And his wife also became like old. His breast was dry. So one day she requested his husband, O oh, Sudama, uh, O oh, my heart, dear husband, your friend is the king of, and he is very very much honourable for prime minister. You should only go. Don't ask anything. He will himself give you plenty of. Sudama told, "I will never want beg anything from him. But even I will go and take darshan of that Prabhu, who is the Lord of Lords. That is fruit for him. And then he took some." वो छोटे छोटे कॉर्न चावलर कॉर्न ब्रोकन राइट्स एंड केप थीयर एंड वेंट देयर व्हेन ही वेंट देयर ओ कृष्ण साहब आई एम इम्प्रेस्ड हिम एंड ही गेट द सेम सीट व्हेन ही यूज्ड टू सीट ऑन द कॉर्ट ऑफ रुक्मिणी देवी एंड हिमसेल्फ ही वॉश्ड हिज फीट ऑल द क्वींस Hmm? They were 
Sarhi. Oh, Pipra. Who is that Pipra? That Krishna is serving himself. Hmm? That Krishna. Hmm. So, Dama Pipra th thought that perhaps he is not recognizing that I am Sam Brahm Sudama. Then Krishna told at the time of taking, Oh, you remember friend, we went one day in night and very heavy rain, you remember? Oh, then he told that, Oh, he knows everything. Next day, Pramadipra told that, now please order me to go. My Brahmi will be waiting, uh, waiting for me. And then Krishna gave nothing, nothing and nothing. And empty handed he returned in the way he was thinking. Oh, Krishna is very merciful. If he will give wealth, then I will be bewildered. False ego will come. I cannot do bhajan. That is why he is so merciful that he had not given. But when he returned to his cottage, oh, where is my cottage? No cottage. Instead of that, of oh, very beautiful palaces. Not only, you know, so many. And he saw that, oh, come him. Cows are there. How much? 16,108 cows. And so many things. All the queens, there were 16,108. Each they gave some water pot. Each they gave so many things to clean, but Krishna is very merciful. In Dwarka he did not get him, but like rain comes in the night and Krishna farmers become heavy in the night so much rain and then they began to plow on their fields. In the same way Krishna did not give him in front of animal, huh? in go, in way. He gave everything to him and told that, Oh, you are my friend, you will not be attached in all these things. When he reached there, his wife with so many maid servants, she came with paraphernalia of Arti. But he saw that, oh, very beautiful young lady is coming. Who are they? He began to run away. But his wife, when she touched, at once she became very young, very beautiful. Then, why if Sudama Vipra by mercy of Krishna, will be very young and very beautiful. Then his wife will not recognize. But his wife will recognize him in any way. So first he did his wife young and beautiful, and then by touching her, he became beautiful. So Krishna is so merciful. So try to be like. Akinjan Vaishnava Rai Sudama Vipra. Go Prema. There is one mala, someone has left their bead bag, so anyone, uh, this bead bag belongs to can come and take it. So again tomorrow, Shil Gurudev will be speaking at 5 o'clock, followed by which there will be a drama. Go Prema Anande, Hari Hari Go. Radha Ramana Hari Govinda Jai Jai Radha Ramana Hari Govinda Jai Jai Radha Ramana Hari Govinda Jai Jai Radha Govinda Jai
Thank <laughs> you. 